guys, this is Nasha XX Owen and this is Holly and Hemis. And today we're going to be teaching you how to do the walk for brain. So, so basically, <laughs> remove this <laughs> get over here. Remove all her fringe and her short bits. Good like idea. this. Put that over there. So just get her to hold that. And then get a small section. And split it into two like you're going to do a twist. Then twist it, you want to know how to twist. Then get a piece of hair right next to it. And the one that's behind it, so this one, you're going to put that under, then that one over. And then twist it again, so it leaves that. And then tighten that. And then get a piece next to it. And pull it over that one, under that one, like that, and twist, and pull, keep really tight, and pull these, and twist them, and then get the next piece right next to it, like that, and you pull it over, then under, and twist, and then pull, and then twist again. Because basically the reason, some people don't twist tw twice, but I find it a bit more tighter if it just holds a bit longer. So that's what I do. Then over, then under, and twist, pull, twist, and then go around again. And then get the next piece of hair, put it over and under. And twist, pull, twist, and then the next piece of hair over, under, twist, twist again. And then lift up all this piece of hair and put it like over her head or get her to hold it. Can you hold all that over? And then slide it. It's secure. <laughs> and then part her hair. <coughs> that is how you do the waterfall braid. Turn around. Yeah, so it's like that. So thank you so much for watching and um, let us know what you want us to do. Like anything with hamsters or anything. So see you later guys. Bye. Bye. Of course.